This is my first cruise on the USS Independence, and this uh, this is the command I checked into. Uh, you have 32 Egyptian swordsmen. Uh, that's the sword on the back. Um, the picture is on the angle. Uh, that's just the way I took the picture. I think it gives a little bit more uh, graphics. This is in the hangar bay down in Virginia Beach, Virginia. And uh, next to it, to the left in the backdrop is uh, is uh, my uh, or our sister squadron, which are the Top Hatters, and that's the little symbol on the back. That's the sword right there on uh, on that one. So that was my first, uh, I think, my first day on the job in the squadron, uh, brand new, uh, basically in the Navy right out of A school. And uh, we'll flip over here. This is on the first cruise. This is the schedule. The pink means we're home ported. Okay, and then we do uh, we go underway. This is at sea. And then we go to the Nassau Bahamas, and uh, stay at sea. Come back to port and uh, in um, Norfolk, Virginia, uh, Virginia Beach, and back out to sea in transit to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Uh, at sea again in St. Uh, Thomas the Virgin Islands, and then uh, home port for a long time. Then underway, underway, which is uh, Med Cruise uh, 80, 82, and then uh, we pull in over here. To uh, Naples, Italy. Yeah, let's go back up to July here. Uh, that's one time out to sea, back two more days uh, in Naples, go out to sea for uh, almost a month, and then back to sea for a week and a half at Naples, which is a really nice long time. Uh, then back to sea for about another month, we pull into Athens, Greece, and then another month we out chop, which means uh, uh, we're leaving. Uh, the Mediterranean, and we uh, this says road to Spain for one day. I think we were there for more than one day because I remember it very well. Uh, not too many pictures on on uh, uh, on this uh, video for road, but uh, I've been we've been there before. I've been there before. Then uh, at sea, and, and uh, it only takes about a week or so to get back to home home port. So that's the whole year uh, of uh, these are all debts. Uh, workups, uh, so work up there, or work up there, um, and then uh, we're home for uh, you know about three weeks, and then go out to sea for six months. So that was the way the the uh, cruises went back then. So um, going over here, uh, we left Virginia, went down to Nassau on the first detachment. That was four days in port of Nassau, and then uh, that's what it looks like with a Tomcat going off the catapult three. Let's see, one, two. I think that's catapult two uh, over there. Um, they're all steam catapults, and this is on the USS Independence. And then our uh, next workup, uh, we left out of here, went down to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Uh, there'll be more pictures on, on the next uh, video that went up, cruise number two of Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Um, and uh, actually, the cruise book is uh, is pretty. Got, they got some pretty good uh, pictures in there. Uh, four days down there. And I uh, went ahead and visited uh, Disney. It was Disneyland down there, I think. World is over on the other side. I think that's how it goes. But that's a nice picture of uh, the castle. And um, and we went from there down to, to St. Thomas. And once again, more more pictures in St. Thomas on the next video. Um, and uh, we were on the Liberty boat, went in, and I uh, went backwards, you know, looked in reverse with the uh, camera and snapshot. As you see the anchor down. Uh, that's the chain of the anchor. We're anchored off the port. Other ships out there too. Um, these are all the pictures uh, on this. Is uh, they're not digital. They are uh, actually uh, they. I was I took a regular picture with a colored camera, and then uh, recently just turned them into digital. That's why you see uh, a little fragments all over the place. Okay, this is the uh, the the anchor coming up. The antennas are down. Means no ships are next to us, and that's in the, that's a normal condition. Uh, engines are running, uh, water's coming out, and that's being pulled up. You can see the water drop down. These are Corsair, A7 Corsairs. There's a Tomcats over there. The green shirts are maintenance guys, uh, whether they're a flight deck uh, crew, catapult guys, or um, or uh, guys that work on the aircraft. I was a green shirt for a while. Brown shirt are the guys with the tie-down chains. Uh, there's a, 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 a purple shirt back there. These uh, fuels. Okay, and a yellow shirt over there is the aircraft director. So uh, don't see any white shirts here. White shirts are troubleshooters and safety. Okay, uh, this is part of an air show that we held. Uh, F-14 is back here. Corsair is right there. I think there's A-6s up there. 
Don't know why the color's like that. On the picture, it's not like that. Uh, there's a white sky. And they're shooting some missiles down. That's the missiles coming down. And those are the start of the explosions in the water. And that's the bigger ones. So, right off the ship. And we're doing some refueling here. Uh, they shoot uh, some kind of a, a lanyard or something across, and they pull the hoses across. They keep a nice, uh, safe distance away. You notice the antennas are up right there. That's because we have a ship alongside. The aircraft are pulled in tail over deck. Normally they're tail over water. So they're pulled tail over deck. So in case we collide, these stanchions won't hit the aircraft. Now, um, Later in, uh, in uh, let's see, I think cruise number five or six, this is cruise number one, five or six, we did have a collision at sea in the uh, Persian Gulf, which was pretty interesting. I was actually uh, uh, in back of that island, uh, back aft, right along the deck edge. So we got uh, pretty close to that collision. This is from a different view, same thing. You can see the nice choppy water while uh, the ship's uh, moving along, staying in sync, same speed while they're transferring fuel. The fuel is for the air, aircraft and uh, the ship. The ship is a diesel sh diesel ship, so it needs uh, it's not a nuclear ship. The independence was a diesel ship. That's the island, and there's the uh, Corsairs, there's the uh, 14s, and that's a Hummer. That's E2. Those blades are really dangerous when they're spinning around. And there they are, spinning around right there. Okay, there's all the directors, there's the maintenance guys. The red, the guys in red are ordnance and firefighters. And there's uh, some more back here. They're ready for any kind of emergency goes on. That's a white shirt right there. He's a troubleshooter, giving a thumbs up, up to this guy. And they're looking at the, that's the, that's the thing that goes in the catapult. Okay, it pulls the aircraft down uh, via steam. And that's the jet blast, jet blast deflector back here. There's the rocket Gibraltar. As we go into uh, go into there now, I have some maps uh, that'll be uh, coming up pretty soon that I actually charted this. This me as a third class, being on uh, Poland and Sponson with the uh, Ike Eisenhower back there. Where we're leaving them on station in the Mediterranean. And this is uh, the maps that I actually charted. A Rip in there, right there. But uh, the red is coming in, the black is going out. So coming in, we came through here, and uh, the rock of Gibraltar. Where is the rock? The rock is. Uh, hmm. I think the rock's right in here someplace. This area right here. Uh, I'm gonna move on. Uh, this is three times that we hit Naples in 1982. I actually put 1981 there. I didn't do a cruise in 81. So 92, 82. <laughs> All right, but a lot of moving around, going back and forth. Uh, just doing a lot of flying, uh, coming through here. Now somewhere around here we hit Greece. Um, I don't have a poor call at Greece, but uh, maybe I missed that. But uh, we, we did hit a lot of that, and uh, we pulled in the Greeks. It was on the, the calendars. Uh, the uh, at, that was Athens, Greece. So uh, this is uh, actually over here is Beirut, and this is the time when the uh, barracks in Beirut got hit, uh, got bombed. So we were, uh, this is called Bagel Station uh, back then. Uh, uh, nice little treat for you. We got visited a lot of times by a Russian bear. And uh, it has all the information down here. That's the uh, VF-32, Gypsy Swordsman, and that's the uh, air crew's name. Uh, this is unclassified, and that's the date that this picture was actually taken. That's CVW, uh, I mean, this is yeah, USS Independence, and there's Kerry Air Group 6. Nice little bit of history right there. So I hope you liked the video. Uh, please feel free to share it with a friend, and keep an eye out for some more, because this is number one of probably eight or nine. Um, and uh, there's two before this, too. So I uh, hope you get a chance to watch them all. Uh, take care. Bye.